Hi folks, it's good to be with you <clears throat> and love to everybody out there. I just um, want to share some thoughts about Ali Dawa and um, he's an Islamic apologist uh, in Hyde Park and he's been stalking uh, Tommy Robinson and wanting a debate with Tommy Robinson. Um, I encourage that. I, I wish uh, Tommy Robinson and Ali Dawi would have a debate and uh, let the truth come out about Islam and that Islam is a, a religion that wants to dominate politically the nations that it resides in. Um, so I wish they would debate and I think Tommy Robinson would win that debate very easily. Um, but the thing that I find disturbing about Ali Dawa is that he keeps accusing Tommy Robinson of radicalising certain individuals who, one of them in particular, committed uh, a murder. And I think that's terrible to accuse Tommy Robinson of radicalising somebody who's done a murder or a, a terrorist act. I think that's really reprehensible of Ali Dawa to accuse Tommy Robinson of that. I think it's despicable. Um, <clears throat> the other thing I find disturbing about Ali Dawa is he makes these accusations against Tommy Robinson, but um, he's committing, uh, he's doing what is called taqiyya. Uh, Muslims are allowed to lie and in order to advance Islam. Uh, particularly the Shia side, but also Sunnis, Sunni uh, Muslims are allowed to as well, but uh, Shia especially. But uh, the doctrine of Taqiyya is the idea that you can lie um, to advance uh, Islam. Now, I know I get a lot of uh, comeback from Muslim scholars. Uh, they'll make accusations and say, uh, you don't understand Taqiyya, you don't understand, it's, it's very complex etc but I mean the basic bottom line is Muslims are allowed to lie in order to advance uh, Islam and uh, Ali Dawa is uh, committing taqiyya um, and is being completely dishonest and lying to the British public and lying to to many many young Muslims out there in Britain and in Europe and around the world and the lie is simply this is he accuses Tommy Robinson of promoting violence yet uh, he supports a particular preacher he's on record as supporting a particular preacher and encouraging young Muslims to go and listen to a preacher who is on record of stating um, that you can beat uh, your slave wife that you can uh, kill an apostate uh, and he's in record of supporting such a preacher and he's on record of encouraging many young people to go and listen to such hate preachers so you don't hear about this from Ali Dawa generally uh, you don't hear about uh, this side of Ali Dawa um, and a lot of these Muslim apologists are telling you one thing from one side of the mouth but actually they believe something on the other side and they'll dress cool, they'll dress uh, they might dress in religious robes or they might dress very cool and uh, they give the impression that they are these tolerant Muslims who uh, don't want ISIS and think ISIS is terrible yet who Ali Dawa said, you know, we don't want ISIS, we don't want Tommy Robinson and we don't want ISIS. But yet, these kind of apologists are actually, if you scratch behind the scenes, actually promote and encourage young Muslims to watch the most hateful and vile hate preachers. And when I mean hate preachers, I mean people who are encouraging beating your wife people who are who have encouraged um, the killing of apostates 
and I could give you one specific example with Ali Dawa if if he wants me to debate him or discuss it I'm happy to do that but I can give specific example I can give a specific example with Ali Dawa where he makes it absolutely clear that he thinks Tommy Robinson is uh, radicalized someone to commit murder and yet on the other hand he's made it clear that he wants young Muslims to go and watch videos of a hate preacher a Muslim hate preacher who encourages beating your slave wife and who encourages killing apostates so that's Takia and a lot of these Muslim apologists um, they're not being honest with you they're lying to you they, they, they want to advance Islam so they will tell you anything and, and the narrative that they want to play to you is uh, we're, we're tolerant Islam is tolerant uh, these uh, right-wingers are hate preachers they're Islamophobes anybody who criticizes Islam is an Islamophobe but they're jumping on the bandwagon of this political correct identity politics and they're using it and hijacking it to 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 cover themselves and protect themselves from criticism but the reality is it's they are the ones that actually are promoting hate preachers behind the scenes to their young people and this can be proved absolutely clearly concerning Ali Dawa and if I was to do more investigation I could give you more evidence concerning other young uh, up-and-coming apologists so there's a double standard going on so remember this Ali Dawa and Takia Ali Dawa and the doctrine of Takia God bless you take care